Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode. Today I got another exciting review for you guys. Um, this one's actually just going to be a quick review just because I've gotten a couple of sneakers in. Um, and I want to kind of get these sneakers posted and make a video for them because um, I will be on vacation next week. So I definitely want to upload as many videos as possible before then. Um, so sorry if I do not go in depth on this shoe like I normally do. But I just, like I said, want to just get these videos out there for you guys. Um, <clears throat> so the sneaker we're going to be looking at today is nothing crazy. Just a GR pair. One that's still currently sitting on a lot of websites. So if you guys are interested in buying these, you'll be more than able to do so. Um, but before we get into the shoe guys, if you guys can just hit that subscribe button and notification bell. It definitely helps this channel out a lot. And the shoe we're going to be looking at today is the Nike Dunk High in the Lakers colorway um, or the purple and yellow colorway, whatever you guys want to call these. Um, so when I first saw pictures of these, I definitely loved them. I've always been a big fan of those purple colors on sneakers. Um, I think it just gives it a nice look, a nice pop to your footwear. And the yellow accents on this shoe make it that much better. Again, it kind of has like that Lakers tone. These aren't officially that, but they've dubbed them that obviously for the colorway. Um, and these, like I said, are still sitting at a lot of retailers. Um, I've seen them locally and I've definitely seen them online as well. Um, and like I stated, if you guys are interested in these, I'll be posting all the retailers in the description box below if you're interested in buying a pair. Um, these do retail for $125. And just an overall great shoe guys the quality on the materials again nothing crazy if you've purchased any gr dunks within the last couple of years um, that's not a premium chances are the quality is the same as what you're going to get on these um nothing has changed if you guys saw my previous video on the nyx colorway uh same material on these synthetic synthetic leather all the way around nothing crazy um Here's a look at the purple outsole, real nice. You got that nice white midsole to kind of contrast the other two colorways on the shoe. And like I stated, the upper is a purple and yellow tone. You got that purple on the swoosh, yellow on the heel tab, the mid panel, and the toe box. You got your yellow laces, and then you got your yellow nylon tongue there with your purple piping, yellow Nike tab, yellow tongue tab, and then you got your Nike in that purple branding. Here's a look at the back there. Nothing crazy with these guys. I just happen to love the colorway a lot, that purple and yellow. I kind of wish these would have came out in low top version. I think that would have made this sneaker a hundred times better. But I'll take what they give us. Um, so maybe in the future they'll drop a low. Who knows? Um, I could see them definitely doing a low top version of this shoe. And I think that would be incredible. They did do the blue and yellow color recently. Um, which I thought was a great looking shoe. I did not go ahead and purchase those. Um, I might in the future. Just because the retail on those. Sorry, the resale on those isn't much above retail. Um... But yeah, let me know what you guys think of these. Is this a must have for you? Did you guys already purchase these or is these an easy pass? Um, like I said, retailing at 125 and pretty accessible like a lot of the Nike Dunk Highs are right now. Um, I'm still hoping that at some point soon, the lows will be as accessible as the highs are. Um, I know a lot of people prefer the lows over the highs like myself, um, but I think it'll definitely be great to be able to see the lows just sitting on shelves just like these highs are currently um but yeah i just wanted to give you guys a quick look at these like i said nothing crazy on the quality of the materials but the colorway was definitely one that i loved um it definitely reminds me of a lot of the goofy boy low sbs that dropped years ago um obviously those were a different material um but the color toning was very similar to this pair here i'll post a picture somewhere above here just to kind of give you guys a comparison look um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for these guys. Let me know what you guys think of these. Um, let me know if you guys are planning on buying these or if you've already bought them. But like always guys, thanks for the support. Please like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.